anytime I want to believe that the airline industry actually cares about us, I'm reminded, I'm reminded by all the hundreds of canceled flights. I'm reminded when I get stories from everyone I know, it's always a horror story. And the one thing that most people don't care for is the design and layout of these planes. If this is the seats, could you imagine what the bathroom looks like? This is Southwest new rollout for their new interior that they're going to put into planes starting next year. We've seen planes get smaller in um, seat size, overhead size, and leg room over the past 10 to 15 years. And it seems like every year it gets gradually worse. And the little placement of the iPad and phone to show us that we'll be able to have a spot to put our iPad is not, it's not winning for me. I mean, look at this, look how tight and compact these legs rooms is. If you're a six foot man, you're probably suffering in these seats already as it is. And now to see this design, of seats that are like, look how thin and flimsy that is. That can't be supportive for your back. That can't be comfortable in any way, shape or form. Even the handlebars look uncomfortable. It's almost as if Southwest is telling you, we don't want you flying more. We want you to stay home. They're making these planes for people who are 5'2 and 100 pounds. They're not making it for people that are above 5'4. I could tell you that. Anytime I see people over five, just say 5'8 on these planes, they look so uncomfortable.